like uh, in my class we had another teacher who would sit in and like observe what is it the student teacher or teacher student whatever where they're trying to observe to be a teacher themselves yeah. Uh, after probably like winter break or whatever, I got moved into her class, and I was like, "Look, I'm tired of moving." So I definitely didn't talk then. Yeah, and second grade was just awful, actually. <laughs> so. Hmm. Interesting. Third grade. Um, it was okay. Oh yeah. It just like that. That's how only be in that grade because during you know when it was like warm outside and everything, she always had the windows open. No, that was fourth grade. Wait, third grade, third grade, third grade. My teachers... Yes, I remember third grade. Very boring. Next. Fourth <laughs> grade. That was when... I was in high school. Yeah, that was senior. That was when I was in high That me and my two boyfriends pretty much split up. That was terrible. You guys, I was pretty much picked up in between... Uh, This is a trend with you. What? <laughs> this is a trend. I see this. Oh, gosh. It's so shallow. Well, we gotta wrap it up. We got, like, two more minutes to talk about this. <laughs> yeah. That's all right. Fifth no? grade. Fifth grade. <laughs> what about fourth grade? Wow. Who can't count? I just said, I was just in fourth grade. You just said third grade. No, I said third, first grade through, um, let's say kindergarten, first grade was when I had, um, my first two boyfriends. Whoa. And I said, by the time kind of fourth grade, that's when I got my, my other boyfriend when I broke with those two. Were you not listening to me? <sighs> You're not making sense. Wow. I'm so confused. I didn't hear the fourth, you know, alright. Fifth grade. Anything for you? Nothing for me. What? Okay, fifth grade, Elaine. Seventh grade was um, when I started taking my tagging seriously. And I started to really make um. In which my, grade? My sketchbook started to expand more to a black book, a graffiti black book. So it went from just my regular drawings of people and things to being more of the, you know, the, the graffiti things. So yeah. How about you? Which grade? Seven. Oh, you got something to say about fifth and sixth? No, I was, I was just like... I was asking you, and you used anything. Uh, seventh grade. I'm going to play back your thing I'm talking about. Let's see. I left my first middle school three weeks into the school year. So once again, in seventh grade, I didn't talk because I was like, what is up with all this moving? But, um, let's see. At the school that I moved to, uh, I wanted to be 
con to continue playing my little clarinet. <laughs> yeah, I forgot I played that. Anyway, but I wanted to play basketball, and they were like, well, the athletic period and the band period is the same time. And I was like, oh, basketball. And so I stopped playing that. And I started playing basketball. Well, I didn't start, but like, yeah, I chose basketball over it. And. Yeah. During recess, I literally, like, 98% of the time I'm playing with guys. Because the girls don't like to do the stuff that I want to do. They don't like to flip around or wrestle or, you know, just play basketball or throw the monkey bars and climb on. Yeah, they don't want to do that stuff. You know, all the girls want to do is swing on the swing, sit down and talk. You had some soft yeah. ass girls, son. <laughs> girls in Texas yeah. get down, <laughs> yo. <laughs> I was out there hooping with the boys, of course. You know, doing all this. I just started wrestling with the guys and all that stuff with the guys. And couldn't do that stuff with the girls. They started crying. And I was like, hey, she hurt me. Hey, she hurt me. I didn't play with girls. Me and girls couldn't do a lot. Hurry. Like, even as I get older, yeah, me and females. Mm -hmm. nah. So you're lucky, Shrek. You're lucky. So how's recess for you, huh? Recess? Um, once, let's see, let's see. I don't even think we had recess when I was in kindergarten. For, yeah, we did, never mind, I retract that statement. It was boring, though. But, uh, when I went to that new elementary school in Tejas, recess was aight. From, like, second to fourth grade, I'd, I'd stay by the door and wait for it to be over because I didn't feel like being upset. <laughs> ah, my life! Anyway, yeah, and then fourth through sixth grade, I'd actually go play in ish, go play basketball and da 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 da. Dude, the, I don't like I said, I don't know what kind of girls you had over there. Girls in Texas, man, they make the boys cry. <laughs> wow. Uh, yeah. <laughs> there was this one time where this guy, like, did you ever have the thing where people would flip over that bar in front of the swing and then slide down? Yeah, this girl pushed the boy mid swing, and he almost fell off the off the platform. And I was like, "Oh my gosh!" So that's when I stopped playing wow. over there. And I used to do the whole thing on the swings where you would jump off until this kid like crushed. Ah, I don't know what the hell he did, but it's like his leg just ah. It's I can't talk about it. But recess was fun. All in all, ugh, it was so gross. I see. What are we talking about? Um, alright. Um, yeah, we're talking about, um, I was just there for recess. This is the 8th grade. Yay, I was on my way to high school afterwards, so that's what made that year so awesome. It was the last year in my middle school, and then high school hit, and everyone expects the high school to be like it is on, like, the TV shows and the movies. But nah. My high school was nothing like that. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Freshman year, I had a crush on a sophomore and a senior. And, yeah. Tess. Yeah, there you go. Mm. <laughs> that takes care of freshman year. Mm. Uh, pretty much. I don't know. My teachers... They all pretty much stuck up like one of them. I can't remember which one I did, so I guess they all did stuff. And people, I mean, just, just think about it. this high school. Yeah, you know, there's a few people are cool, some people are not. A lot of fights. You know, not just fights, like boys fighting or girls fighting. There's some guys eating the crap out of chicks sometimes. Okay. And some sixties, especially some sixties, the crap out of guys, a lot of times. And that happened a lot. Those fighting things, you get that probably, I'm just saying, um, oh, once a month. It was one major fight. <laughs> once a month? <laughs> yeah, I'm not kidding. Once a month, it was one really big fight. Like, you'd all see, everyone would see, like, during lunch hour or whatever. It would be either... Between two guys or two girls or a guy and a girl just going at it. 